steadily squeaking our way into October here, and uh, I see something on this watch that reminds me of some, something a little creepy. I don't know, it kind of reminds me of a poisonous snake or a caution tape or something along those lines, but obviously that's not why I chose this piece. But this one is the Aquaterra Seamaster 15,000 Gauss. If you don't know what I'm talking about, what this means is that this watch is heavily resistant to magnetism, so unlike going uh, other watches in the past where you'd walk through an airport or if you're a surgeon or something like that a lot, around a lot of heavy electrical equipment, this watch cannot be magnetized by most things uh, that you encounter on a daily basis, so this is just an awesome piece. Now, obviously, we've known that Meta's testing through Omega has now actually exceeded those th this barrier, and this is not the only watch that has that value. Of course, anything that is chronometer certified from them now is... Uh, magnetism resistant up to 15,000 gauss but this is just a really cool example of it I really like the aesthetic of it it's your aquaterra you have your step down dial on the outside and your applied markers I just think it's a really cool styling